Hello friends. So far I've been getting my anamorphic fix uh, using either the Vida Tladikoval aperture filter or by buying modded vintage lenses that uh, contain the oval aperture on the back of the modded lens. When it comes to real anamorphic lenses, I have bought the Mundog Labs one and the Moment one a few years ago. These are both for, the, for smartphones. Um, however, one of the two can be adapted to be used with uh, all Micro Four Thirds cameras and some specific Canon ones that I will mention later. To start off, you need the Moondog Labs 37mm screw-on anamorphic lens with a filter holder accessory. The other types won't work, you ne really need the 37mm thread on the back. Then you screw it on the lenses uh, that have a 37mm thread or you get step-down rings to 37mm from 43mm or 46mm lenses. Some lenses with these diameters can still work with the Moondog, but others can't. So the Moondog anamorphic adapter can work with all Micro Four Thirds cameras, the Canon M50 and the Canon EOS M using the Magic Lantern uh, firmware in 3x crop mode. For Micro Four Thirds cameras, you can use these lenses: Olympus 17 mm f/2.8, Olympus 14 to 42 mm zoom, and the Panasonic Power Zoom equivalent. And also any lens that has a simple optical design or it's uh, rather long and with a, but with a small physical aperture. On a Panasonic camera, that makes the Olympus zoom lens uh, a 66mm lens, a full frame equivalent, which is a bit too long for anything useful really. The Olympus 17mm has some vignetting in normal 4K mode, but it covers if you use the 1.4x teleconverter mode found on Panasonic cameras. The 17mm is a great lens to use with the original BMPCC, since its crop mode is a whopping 2.88x, and with the various crop modes also found on the BMPCC 4K. On the original BMPCC, the 17mm could be like a 37mm full frame equivalent, which is a great focal length to work on. I'd say that the best usage of the Moondog Labs uh, lens is on the original BMPCC with that 17mm Olympus lens, since it has uh, uh, the least quality deterioration as well. Just make sure you stick a 37mm IR cut filter between the lens and the adapter uh, because otherwise it just doesn't mount correctly. The BMPCC requires an IR cut filter anyway. And um, on top of the Mundoga adapter, you use the filter accessory to add the variable and the filter. That's it, a complete anamorphic camera. I tried a few more MFT lenses, uh, like the Lawa 17mm, 7 Artisans 25mm and the Zonlai 22mm, and this did not work because their aperture was physically too far away from the front element. Only small, simpler lenses, as I said, where the aperture is designed to be near the front will cover fully with a Mundog adapter. I'm sure there are some other long, longer lenses or some C-mount lenses that might cover, but anamorphic mostly shines with wider focal lengths uh, that this would generate, so you need something both wide and fast. Also, I should mention that you must align the adapter properly on the lens each time you screw it on. Another usage of the Moondog lens is to use it with either the Canon M50 in its 4K mode, uh, which has a crop of 2.556x uh, on that mode, or the 3x crop mode found on the Canon EOS M when using the Magic Lander firmware. Uh, with these, uh, with these Canon EOM AFM cameras, you can use the official Canon 22mm f2. That's a wide fast lens um, that can create quite some background blur as you can see in the video and make it more clear uh, that, it's, that you're actually using an anamorphic lens. On a Canon M50 in the 4K mode, the combo makes it a 42mm full frame equivalent lens, which is very usable actually. I'm not aware of any, of any single lens that could cover either EFS Canon cameras, BMPC 6K, Sony or Fuji ones if you attach this adapter. This only works for cameras with high crops since um, the adapter was made for uh, small sensors as found in smartphones. If you already have any of these cameras and lenses mentioned here, then getting the anamorphic adapter and filter adapter might be worth the extra $220 overall. But if not, I'd say, well, don't bother.